All right. Hey guys. Um, so yeah, so yesterday uh, we did um, ingredients and salad dressings that are bad for you. So today we are doing an ingredient that I like. Last time we did spirulina, which was really awesome. I had a lot of people hopping on board and actually trying it out. Um, today we're going to do something that you can actually take in pill form or you can add it to your cooking and it tastes awesome. We're talking maca powder. I hope you can see that. This one is organic. So what is maca powder? Um, love, 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 love this stuff. Oh my God. If you haven't been using this, you're missing out. I can smell it right now. Oh my God. It smells like toffee. It's so, it's so good. Um, and then if you need a boost in the boudoir, listen up to this. This stuff will actually help you out. So <clears throat> maca is from Peru. It grows in the Andes Mountains. Um, they've been using it in Peru for, God knows, thousands of years. Um, not only for cooking, but for medicinal. Um, it is very high in vitamins and minerals. Uh, there's calcium in it, magnesium, iron. Um, there's more fiber in a serving of this than your average potato. Yeah, that's so, it's good stuff. It's got vitamin C, B1, B2, B6, B12. Um, it also can, uh, contains three essential fatty acids that you need. Um, I mean, seriously, this, this thing is like, this is the bomb. I mean, I have my, oh my God, it smells good. Anyways, there are three types of maca powder. This one is, is the yellow one. This is the one that's uh, the one that you find mostly when you go into the stores. Um, the, their differences are red maca is like the most, the purest type of the maca, the Peruvian root. Um, it's got like a malty taste to it and it's got the most antioxidants out of the three of them. Um, it also helps with prostate cancer and bone density loss, so that's an added bonus. Uh, both the red and the black um, have shown uh, good size for the, uh, your bones, and um, the red was actually more beneficial, they found out. But um, it doesn't have the, uh, the thing that you want from the men. <laughs> this is, this is going to get a little shady, shady here. Um, Red, red maca is most beneficial when you want to balance your hormones. It increases uh, strength and stamina, um, and it has the highest amount of amino acids out of all three. I've never actually tasted the red ones. They say it tastes malty. I believe them. Like I said, this one tastes kind of like a toffee. So, um, anyways, it is also the red one is also shown to prove uh, symptoms of depression and, and stress. The black one, however, men has been referred to as natural Viagra. So um, it increases your sperm count. And uh, yeah, so if you're trying to have a kid, <laughs> you want to take the black maca. Um, yellow also has uh, uh, in, uh, an effect on your sperm count and your sex drive. However, the black is the one that they say is the natural Viagra. Anyways. Um, the yellow one boosts your mood, helps with sleep quality, um, boosts your immune system with all the good stuff in it, uh, increases your memory, helps with things like the flu when you get it. Um, th this one, like I said, has a toffee taste to, uh, to it, and let's see, oh, it does it does help too with uh, like menopausal symptoms, and actually men get uh, menopause too. I think it's, it's called a menopause or something like that. I don't know. It's when they want to go out when they're 50 years old and they have decreased libido and they're fatigued and they go buy a motorcycle. Go ahead. I don't know. <laughs> go figure. But anyways, it helps with that. Anyways, like I said, you can use it as a pill. They sell in pill form or you can use it in recipes. Now I use it in um, like the, the protein bites that I make, my protein bars. I put it in my shakes. Um, as I said, this has a, a toffee flavor to it. So when I make my natural chocolates, and what I'll do is I'll take this and mix it in with the coconut oil, um, and then fill the chocolates with it, and then when we put it in the freezer, pull them out, you've got like a toffee flavor uh, with your chocolate. So anyways, you should try it out. It's fairly expensive. This one was, 
this at a regular store would be ten dollars. I got it on sale for six. And this is enough for if you put it in your shakes, it'll go pretty fast. But if you're making it in some like your protein bars and everything, it will go slower. And of course, if you wanted to use it for medicinal, you'd want to use it every day. But at that point in time, I'd probably get a pill form. Anyways, if you have any questions and uh, give me a jingle, send me a message. If you have any questions besides this and you want me to talk about something that you want to know about, send me a message and I'll do that too. And I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Have a good night.